Alright, so we want to head to the Saris Lake Ruin, so we gotta go into the minecart. That's pretty much how that works. But now, there's a new choice! Saris Lake Ruins! There we go. Whee! There's a chest here! Earth ring, but you have no more room. Uh... Now screw this. Okay. Earth ring's not really that great or anything, but it's not bad. Ruins. So this actually puts us near the end of the ruins, which is nice. But we just want to head this way till we get up to the top. You know how it is. That looks kind of unique. You can like see through the little tunnel thing. Bum bum. There we are. Whoa, that is a crazy view. But cool. Bum, 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 bum. There we are. Got my smart water. Go ahead, try the rune. Don't tell me what to do, jerk. Oh boy. Ooh, pretty. Good, good. The flow to the underground water vein is still blocked, and now the upper sluice gate is closed. This is going to be interesting. Let's hurry back. We don't want to miss the start of the operation. So now we want to head back the same way we came, but, you know, you may notice it's a little different. The plan has been set in motion. Time to hurry back. Now when you go out here... There's more water! Just head back around. There's apparently no random battles, so that's a thing. If there were, it'd probably just be old enemies anyway, so wouldn't really matter. Water vein. Heading back to the dwarf camp. That is a nice shortcut, isn't it? You don't have to go all the way back through that. The whole dungeon and everything. And there wasn't even one battle. <laughs> ba 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 ba. Da da na da na na na. Now you can save your game if you want, cause cause there is gonna be a major battle coming up. We just want to talk to Lacrasha. I mean, you could probably guess that, but you know, this room is so small. It's cramped in here. Hey, the prince! Here we are, prince, just like we promised. We deeply apologize for keeping you waiting, your highness. The dragon cavalry has arrived, ready to drive all vile forces from Felena's lands and rivers. That's cool. So we get Flail. And Nick. And Yorin. And of course, Axe. We, the Dragon Cavalry, are ready to push as far as Ceres Lake on your Royal Highness's command. Our Raft Fleet allies are ready as well. 
Your Highness, now's the time to take back our castle. Just give the order. Okay. Let the battle begin. You don't have a choice. <laughs> yeah! I guess everyone in the room cheered, so that's cool. Bum bum bum. Uh-oh. Sir Kilderick, Sir Kilderick, for freaking jerks in my room, you bastard! All right, already. What is it? Something terrible's happening. The lake waters, the lake water level is rising fast. Rising? What the hell? Get the hell out of my room, man! Let's get out of here. Get to higher ground, hurry before it's too late. Get that boat over here. Those who can swim, swim. Shut your trap, man. Why don't you swim? Hey, what are you doing? Stop, stop. Out of my way, Arma scum. We go first. Oh, you're gonna regret saying that. You want a piece of me? Bring it on. Freaking auto scrolling text. Hate that. What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Shut up, Jiden. Nobody loves you. First, I need you to calm down. Now then, it's not like we're on a sinking ship. We still have time. Those foolish soldiers are still fighting amongst themselves. We'll have a massacre between allies on our hands long before we drown. Bah! Allies indeed. What's that supposed to mean? Sir Kilderick! Sir Kilderick! What now? The rebel army! They're here! The rebels here? Impossible. Oh, but it's happening. Okay, so much like battles before this, this one takes place on both land and water. But luckily, the uh, the odds are more tipped in our favor since the enemy doesn't really have that many more units than we do. So that's nice. Uh, we'll get some more charges going. Let's see. Do, do, do. You have charges. Well, what do we want? More charge. Speed. We'll get some recover on you. Recover is always nice. Beavers. So yeah, I, I, I note both beavers and dragon horse cavalry can go on land and water. So that's pretty useful. I don't know what I just did. No. Nah. I don't remember what Gnaw does. I don't recall. But we'll get more of it. Either way. And 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 they also have the flowing rune, which is nice. We don't have anybody on standby for you, that's okay. Yeah, because they can't have anyone else. They don't have any abilities. We we we, we, we gotta give them some abilities, man. But what do we got? Balance, rumors, rest, recover. There you go. It's always nice to have recover. Okay, I think that's good. Uh, yeah. Good time. The recapture. See, they only have like. About 300 more troops, that's not a big deal. Damn it! That incompetent fool! Even the dragon cavalry's here! Damn you, Dolph Ziggler! Damn you to hell! You've ruined everything! Damn, 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 damn! 
Damn. Rally the troops, now! That's just it, sir. Many soldiers fled from the flooding without their weapons and armor. They're practically useless now. Those cowards! Hmm. As long as they have bodies, they're not useless. Put them in front. We'll use them as human shields. <laughs> That's nice. S sir, if I may respectfully do- Something wrong. Would you like to be a human shield too? Huh? N no! I'll see to it at once, sir. The Dragon Cavalry wasn't supposed to be here. Gidan, give me an update on our troop status. I'm sorry to report that about half our forces have deserted us, Commander Sparma. And morale is terrible, even among the troops we do have. Damn cowards. Things aren't looking too good for them. If things get ugly, make a break for it. No sense in us getting killed, too. <laughs> wow. This went even better than I anticipated. It looks like the enemy's been thrown into complete chaos. A little threat of force should send them scurrying out of the castle. But don't pursue them too far. Alright, so if you look at the battle goal, have total enemy forces. Yeah, so you can end, end, you can actually end the battle if you bring Kilderic's HP down by one third, or down to one third. So that's a thing that you can do. So we got some water units. We got our land units are all the way over here, so it's gonna take a while to get them over here. We got some more units here. All those are the same units, I think. Oh no, the, these are our units. Oh, okay, I was looking at it backwards. These are our units, okay. Alright. These are their units, alright. But they're still, like, really far away. Yeah, so there's Kilderich's unit, okay. Alright. So, I forget what, uh... What, what Gnaw does. Can it can only be used against ships. Reduces ship defense by 10%. Cannot use on land. Okay. Let's do this, shall we? Bum bum bum. So we just want to lower their units. Yeah, you, you want to have your beavers go for, uh, ships if you can. Dun dun dun. Bum bum bum. We got some ships. They don't have very many ship units, do they? That's kind of crazy. Bum bum bum. Ram. Oh, oh, there's our unit. We're on a ship. Huh. Yeah, see, that's the great thing about dragon units, is they can go a anywhere. So, so you gotta appreciate that. It looks like there's a unit there, but you can't really target it. Just kind of weird. So you've got star. You've got recover. Flowing. Recover.
Flowing. Lots of flowing. Barrage, Barrage is, 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 of course, always very nice. Dawn and recover. We'll do a little barrage, because why not? Uh, yeah, oh, you gotta select it. Okay. I was gonna say, what the hell's going on? Barrage! Put some holes in their boat. Make it sink. There we go. Do a little star. Gonna hit both their units with it. That's awesome. I mean, obviously. That's just gonna crush them into oblivion. Oh, that is so sweet. Like, you don't even know. Too bad we didn't have more of those, but that's okay. Come, warriors of Sable, show true honor and valor in the battle ahead. It feels like it's been a while since we've seen some sea combat. Hmm, I hardly care to waste my time with such brutes. Mother Earth Rune, because why not? No. Earthquake! Their horses can't stand when there's an earthquake going on. Oh, that's Jidan's unit. It's really getting its ass kicked. Bah! This is looking worse by the minute. To hell with Kilderick. To hell with Godwin. To hell with Felena. I didn't agree to this. Let's get out of here. Y yes, Commander Sparna. Damn our scum! Should have known better than to trust a damn woman. Hurry up and pull out now! Wow, I didn't think it'd end that quick. That's pretty ridiculous. Huh? Okay. So I would say we did pretty much flawlessly. There, I don't think we took. Well, we took a little tiny bit of damage, but not much. I think if you defeat one of the units, you'll you'll get a fog robe, but yeah, you know, it's not a big deal. We got almost thirty thousand potch, so that's a thing. And now our castle reaches its most developed state. Everybody's happy. Dun dun dun. Mm-mm, thanks. That sure hit the spot. I'll definitely be back. Thank you. M my pleasure. Hmm. Kind of awkward, isn't it? You're telling me, I mean, why do we have to act all friendly with those southerners? The prince is fighting against Armus, and yet we're here helping them. It just doesn't feel right. You might have a point. But they're not causing any trouble, and besides, they actually like our food. 
They give pretty good tips, too. <laughs> well, I guess so. Still, I wonder what they're doing here. Beats me. Well. Alania! Commander Valia. The Armist Southern Mountain Corps have, has failed to capture the Rebel Army's headquarters. Actually, it, it, it's more like they failed to hold on to it. I know. Then why do you not take action? Your Western Marine Corps must join the front lines. They did kind of need your help. Commander. Ah, I've been waiting for you, Charmista. How did it go? Oh, Charmista. I remember her. Well, this is what I've discovered. Hmm. I see, I see. Well done, Charmista. I suppose we should return home then. <laughs> what? Inform our soldiers. Yes, Commander. Hold on just one second. I demand to know what's going on. My soldiers and I feel like our vacation's gone on long enough. It was quite fabulous while it lasted, though. <laughs> Shula doesn't give an F. Vacation? Oh, and Charmista, tell the troops not to buy too many gifts for the folks back home. Prices rise when things are in short supply, and that wouldn't be fair to the good people of Estrus. <laughs> you really are something, Commander. Always so thoughtful. I shall do as you say. Kind of looks like she she has a, like a like an Indian headdress thing going on. What the hell do you think you're doing? For Alenia. Are you going to break the agreement with Commander Gazelle? Oh yes, the agreement. Apparently, Gazelle is quite busy researching the Sun Rune. Huh? What does that have to do with the agreement? I think it has a lot to do with it, but never mind that. They'll give you a hard time if you return to the Sun Palace empty-handed. So here's a little something for you. It seems the Island Nations Federation fleet is sailing south towards Estrus as we speak. The Island Nations? I wish I could say Armus was on better terms with the Island Nations, but we're not. So the Western Marine Corps has received orders from our superiors to keep tabs on them until we know what's going on. No hard feelings, okay? Hmm. <laughs> well, that alliance just completely fell apart. Quick. Yeah, so our, now our castle is in the final development stage, which is cool. Which, you know what that means? More areas to explore, and characters have probably moved, and you know, all that fun stuff. Also, there's another choice coming up that'll change the upcoming major battle. So, again. What's that? The Western Marine Corps pulled out. Mm-hmm. Estrus has been liberated. Aren't you happy about that, Boz? Well, of course I am. It's just something rubs me the wrong way, that's all. I mean, there wasn't even a single battle fought. Well, the Island Nations fleet is approaching Estrus. Say what? It's probably just a bluff, mind you. After all, I seriously doubt they want to start a war with Armas. Still, the Western Marine Corps can't just leave without mounting some sort of a response. Let me guess, this was part of your plan, too. Yes, well, after the princess's coronation ceremony, I sent another messenger to Admiral Egan. 
All I said was Godwin may Godwin may well ally himself with Armus. The prince must have made quite an impression on Admiral Egan to have him do so much for us. I stand in all of your mental acumen, Lady Marisus. I'm just glad she's on our side. Huh. I'm surprised the Obel Maritime Council approved it. Even if it is a bluff, one wrong move could spark a war. No, it was all my father's doing. I doubt he even told the Obel Maritime Council anything about it. That sounds like him. If they ever find out, he'll probably just say there were pirates lurking on the high seas. <laughs> yep, sounds like something he'd do. Oh, Bernadette, I could just kiss you, and your father. How could we ever thank you? Oh, stop it. I'm just here as a friend, not as some military official from the island nations. At least now the east should no longer be a problem. Now your chance to strike west and south. Striking's what I do best. Prince, the Armus Southern Mountain Corps still lingers near Sable. Kilderick's army has fallen back past Lelkar, and it now appears that they intend to desperately defend Durat. So that's the two battles we get to choose from? Let's get them both and retake both Durat and Sable. We've got the upper hand now. I bet their soldiers just are just shivering in their little boots, ha! Huh. And as for who to go after first, I say we just kill two birds with one stone. I was thinking the same thing. We're more than capable of striking both of them simultaneously. Still, there's only one of you, your highness, so I'll have to ask you to lead one of the attacks. Who would you rather fight, your highness? So of course I'll, I'll 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 be showing them both off, but first let me think about it. Okay, but please don't take too long, Your Highness. It's not a bad idea to save. 